Oh. I don't remember this being the startup. Whatever. Oh, welcome. Time to play some Portal. Uh, it's been a while, so... Let's see how we do. Oh. I'm playing this with headphones for the first time. I didn't realize that the sound is directional, but... Oh, that's weird. Uh, I don't know if you'll be able to hear this. Okay, I have to pick things up. Well, the toilet's disgusting. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Admission Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities, serious injuries may occur. For your own safety and the safety of others, please refrain from. Turn back. The portal will open in three, two, one. Okay, so I can kind of read Spanish, like a little bit, like maybe like a kindergarten level, but the text went too fast for me to really understand what that said, so I'm sure it was very funny. Oh, the radio dies once you're in here. Interesting. Can I use this to... Wait, what? Am I supposed to bring this? I, I You can't see it, but I just got an achievement. I'm not doing that. Too much work. 26 of these, apparently. Excellent. You know what? I lied. I'm gonna take it until I get bored. First, however, note the incandescent particle field across the exit. Oh this no. This aperture science material immense a patient grid will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. This mean, uh, oh. Well, all right, well that was short. <laughs> I like that these are padded. What? You hear? Oh, there's a radio up there. Please place the weighted storage cube on the 1500 megawatt Aperture Science Heavy Duty Super Colliding Super Button. Hmm. Gotta wait for the portal to open again. Okay. There we go. Oh, nope. Not quite. Well, can't take two of these with me. There we go. Oh, get in there. Perfect. Ah! Please move quickly to the chamber lock as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. <laughs> really has been a long time. A lot easier to tell where the radios are when you have spatial hearing. Can you believe this game came out in 2007? I think it was 2007. The year everything went bad. You're doing very well. Please be advised that a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental fillings, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. And teeth! Hear the radio. Oh, don't get shot. Over there. By the way, I know you also can't see this, but I'm, uh... Can I pick this up? There we go. Very good. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. Okay, I know, I know what to do. You can create your own portals. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. Okay, let's that a little better. 
Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. Most importantly, under no circumstances should you... Okay. Now I have to, like... Hold on. This is where I came from. I want to like get this over there. There we go. Oh, I received the transmission. Very good. It's weird. They always talk about thinking with portals, but you really do have to change the way you think. Oh, this game is easy. I don't, I don't know why anybody would have a problem with this game. Okay, turn the music down a little bit. Very loud. Please proceed to the chamber lock. Mind the gap. Where's that radio? Over there. You guys can hear that, right? Okay, I can't shoot the portal anywhere in here, so, obviously... Hmm. Oh, here we go. Well done. Remember, the Aperture Science Bring Your Daughter to Work Day is the perfect time to have her tested. It's over here, I can hear it. How do I get there? Well... You guys can hear that too, right? I'm not nuts. Alright, I guess it's fine. To ensure the safe performance of all authorized activities, do not destroy vital testing apparatus. For your own safety, do not destroy <laughs> vital testing apparatus. Oh, when you get in the elevator, the sound quality changes. What do I get to shoot people? Welcome to test chamber four. You're doing quite well. Oh. <laughs> Does this count? No. Once again, excellent work. As part of a required test protocol, we will not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. How do I get the frequency? Where's the snare? I don't hear the snare in my headphones. There we go. You guys can't see it. This is number four. It's doing some Morse code thing. I don't know how to read that. Uh, when I was in the Boy Scouts, I ended up taking the the merit badge for it, but the guy was a huge asshole, so I dropped out on the second day and took swimming instead. <laughs> when I was there, in that particular class, there was, um... It was like a... The thing about Boy Scout camp is that when you go with your troop, you get to see all the other troops' problem childs. Like, we had one too. He had, like, weird anger issues he had to take pills for. But... The... <laughs> When I, <laughs> when I was in uh, the Morse code merit badge, there was a kid who would like, he would chew on a spoon. That was his thing. And it, it was very clear to me that the instructor was uh, uh, maybe frustrated is the, the, the wrong word, but he was like disgusted. <laughs> like, what the fuck are you doing? Why are you like, stop chewing that spoon. And that, the kid had like an aneurysm. So I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the good memories. Okay. I hear it. 
Oh. As part of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. Uh, how do I get the, the sound? Oh, someone ain't right. Hold on. We'll fix this. I wasn't gonna do this. I didn't even know this was here. Discovering new things! There we go. Ah! Okay, so I had to reload a save, because I think I knocked the radio in a place that I can't get to. And I figured out how to get this one. I can just figure out where it's supposed to go. There we go. Let's check over here. Anything over here? No, perfect. Okay, well. And everything's Gucci. You just, you just gotta put the portal underneath it and then it'll appear over there. As part of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. Okay. They got rid of these in Portal 2. Quad safety is one of unbelievable. You. Subject name here. Must be the <laughs> Subject here. Ah. Hear it. Coming from over here. Haunting me. All right, well. Is it on top of that thing? Is that where it is? I like can't even really see either way. Let me try. It always puts the portal in a weird way. Oh, it is there! I'm a genius! Except how do I get it off of there? Dang it! I'm gonna get it. Subject phone down here. Got it. Okay. Oh, where am I going? Come on. There we go. Number six. Okay, these puzzles aren't that hard. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they got rid of the bouncing ball puzzles and got those sliding puzzles instead, so... That'll be fun. Yeah, I'm gonna start saving in between all these. So that way I don't have to go back that far. Warning devices are required on all mobile equipment. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to agitate the high energy pellet and have therefore been disabled for your safety. Hazard lights. Good. Now use the aperture science on Speaking of saves, I haven't uh, my my uh, my earliest save from before this is from 2010. It's 12 years ago. Can you imagine? Okay. Listening for the radio, but I don't hear it. Oh. Underneath the stairs. Ah! Ha! Ah. Where, where did it go? Back over there. Uh, okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on.
Get up, please. Thank you. Why is it sometimes red and sometimes green? Okay. That works. All right. Okay. The ambience is really nice. Despite how old this game is, it's still there's still a lot of like modern stuff that has really not been replicated well going forward. We focus on things like graphics, and while graphics are important, I just I don't know. Please note that we have added a consequence for failure. Oh. Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record, followed by death. Good luck. I believe it will bounce once. There we go. There we go. Okay. The radio seems to be in the wall. Oh, actually, I should get on that platform first. The cool thing is you can look and see where the platform is before you land on it. Wow, isn't game design crazy? Okay, but I hear it, but where? Oh, uh, you know what? Let's do. Very impressive. Please note that any appearance of danger is merely a device to enhance your testing. Ah, experience. okay, there it is. There we go. Hope I don't have to bring it over there. I'm going to be upset if I do. I have to bring it over there. Uh, okay. It is okay. There's nothing cool under the water I checked. The Enrichment Center regrets to inform you that this next test is impossible. Make no attempt to solve it. Oh, oh, look at that. I think I can get that off, maybe? No. Oh. You really can't throw it very far. Alright. The Enrichment Center apologizes for this clearly broken test chamber. Oh, actually, let's do this. Love that classic source physics. All right. Once again, the enrichment center. Fantastic. You remain resolute and resourceful Ooh, in an okay. atmosphere of extreme pessimism. It's gone. God damn it. Okay, well, hold on. Let me reload that. Okay. All right. The Enrichment Center apologizes for this clearly broken test chain. Okay. Fantastic. All right. You remain resolute and resourceful. I don't know why it, when I click the button, it doesn't pick it up correctly. Pessimism. All right. Okay. Hello again. To reiterate, previous one. Oh, okay, right. Um, here we go. Except I wanted to. Oh, well. Oh. 
Hopefully there's nothing under those stairs. Spectacular. You appear to understand how a portal affects forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. Yeah, I can hear it. Like, over here. Can I, like, shoot it in one of these lights? No? Alright, well... Oh, actually, no, okay, there we go. I have to look at it. I see. Hey, by the way, this is a, a mark of contention that I have with the sequel. You cannot put a portal on a moving surface, just for the record. Though, I suppose the Earth is moving, but... You understand what I mean. That's why I couldn't put the portal there. I just, just want to bring that up in case I ever do Portal 2. Momentum. A function of mass oh. and velocity is conserved between portals. In layman's terms, speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. Okay, it's clear what I have to do. Oh, okay, let's try that again. Come on. Oh, nope, almost. Got it. Okay. Remember, press E to place and then press the left trigger to throw. I'll trigger the mouse button. There we go. Awesome. Nice and easy. Getting the radio is tickling my brain. The Enrichment Center promises to always provide a safe testing environment. In dangerous testing environments, the Enrichment Center promises to always provide useful advice. For instance, the floor here will kill you. Try to avoid it. <laughs> Oh, look, I can see myself. Oh. Oh. Oh, come on. Okay, I gotta get the thing from over there to over here. Can I make portals over there? I can't. Okay. We got this, we got this. Oh, well, yep, there we go. Okay, perfect. Well, that's a little annoying. Okay, figured it out. Then I don't know how to get the radio. Oh, it's up there? Certainly is interesting. The device has been modified so that it can now manufacture two linked portals at once. As part of an optional test protocol, we are pleased to present an amusing fact. The device is now more valuable than the organs and combined incomes of everyone in. Subject phone call, here. Hmm, that's gonna be tricky. Hmm. I need to leave that door open and get the portal over there in a matter of time. Hmm. Radio. Hmm. 
Nope. Okay, let's not do that. Ah! I solved the puzzle. It now counts. Ah, oh, is it really that easy? <laughs> no! Okay. Alright, well, I got it. Okay. You need to stop making that no god awful noise. Okay. I got it. It's okay. I'm sure it's fine. There's 26 of them? Oh. Into space. I don't know about that. Yeah, get behind these, but they don't really do anything. Why can't I put a portal there? Here we go. Okay. All right. So. All right, and then we'll do one there. Pro tip, you can shoot portals underneath you, so that way you never have to aim where you're landing. Oh no, I can't put a portal there because it, it can't move, which means, well... There's this really stupid picture about, with like a cube, and it's like, if the portal uh, uh, is like on a piston and it, and it launches the portal down, what would happen to the cube? The answer isn't A or B, it's the portal won't work because it's it's moving. That's literally the answer. Anyone gives you any other answer than that, they're wrong. I don't care. I don't care what happened in Portal 2, okay? <sighs> um, is a switch? Oh, there is. Okay. Okay. Okay, I can shoot through there, but it's not anything relevant. But where? It's the exit. Where's the... Ah, uh, curiosity. I can hear it. It's like over there. Oh. Let's do this instead. It's over there. I can hear it. You can't fool me. Way to get over there? Oh. Okay. <laughs> uh. No way. It's, it's literally, you just stand on this. And you crouch, and then you carefully walk over. Oh, okay, this took me... I always tend to overcomplicate things. This was a lot simpler than I made it out to be. Dang it! I hope I don't need to bring it down, all right. Well, I have to bring it down anyway, because I gotta jump through the hole, so. No, no! Dang it. Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Pick it up! There we go. Okay. No? Tell me I gotta bring it to the beginning. I'll put the cube back on. <laughs> All right, here we go. 
Whoosh. No? Okay, yeah, it's the beginning. All right. Astute listeners may notice this theme from somewhere. I'm not going to say where it is, though. No? Am I nuts? I brought it everywhere. Usually it's the beginning or the end, or at least some other room. Uh, oh, well, yeah, that'll do it. Oh. Got it! Okay, alright, let's get out of here. Woo! Okay, that took a lot longer than I want to admit. 